Hey guys, we have a very special episode for you today. It's going to be a kind of a two-in-one episode, all about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, because there's this new movie, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie coming out. So the two things we're going to review are macaroni and cheese and a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle puzzle. So you can, what's funny about this is this says beat this. It'd be funny if that one said eat this. Just just something I was thinking about. Alright, so we're going to kind of split this off into two, two different videos, but it will be in the same video. So we're going to have Mike work on this one later on, and I'm going to uh, review this one. So Mike, let's throw it over to you. How's it going with that puzzle there? Hey scumbag, thanks for checking in with me. So well, I'm I didn't gonna, even open it yet. I'm going to get into this right now and just describe to you a little Don't bit. Don't bother. Don't bother yet. Oh, oh, what's that? We don't want to throw it to you yet because you're you haven't even opened the puzzle yet. We want to show it when you're actually working on it. And All right. no, I, well, I didn't start it yet. I was gonna kind of introduce it and then throw it back to you. They don't care about the box. All right. No, no one cares about the introduction. Just we'll cut back to you in about ten minutes once you get a good start on it. Thanks. He said he's gonna check in when he's ready when I start working on it. So I'll start working on it. Anyway. So back to the mac and cheese. Now it doesn't taste like anything like Ninja Turtles. It just tastes like regular Kraft macaroni and cheese. But the, I guess the fun thing is that they taste or they're shaped like Ninja Turtles. And you can look at the box. Why look at the box while eating it and think, oh wow, this product is related to Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's fun that I'm eating it. You know things like that. Let's open the box and see what it looks like inside. Let's see what the things look like. That's the powdered cheese. And there's the actual macaroni. So let's do another fun game and see if you can tell which character is which. You can see I got all five of the different characters here. So why don't you write in the comments which character you think is which. And I'll label these on the screen so you can... So you know how to reference them. And if you get them, first person to get them all right will get a shout out in my, in my next video. So here they are, all five of them, five different ones. Let's see who knows the most about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So you can see this is what it looks like. Lots of fun different shapes. Mike, let's throw it back to you with a puzzle. How's it going? You idiot. Hey loser, thanks for checking in. So I have them all turned face up. And this is how you really want to get started. And first, you always want to find the corner pieces. How are you doing, Mike? We'll check in back in when you get a little more progress than that. You barely have anything done yet. Good. How's that cheese coming along? So anyway, back to the cheese here. Yeah, it's going great, by the way. Thanks for asking. All right. That's thank you. That sounds pretty good. So why don't we just stay on my focus on my on this video for now, and they can watch me do the puzzle. And then we'll throw it back to you once the ch mac and cheese is cooked. How about we don't do that? Sounds like a stupid idea. No. All right. I'll worry about the directing and editing. You. All right. Take it easy. You just worry about working on that dumb puzzle. See you later, jerk. I have a special surprise for you. Movie magic. Now watch. I'm gonna slide these off screen and turn them into freshly cooked macaroni and cheese. Keep my hand moving so you can see. Put them in a bowl. Look at that. I think I might have added too much water. But this is what it looks like when it's actually cooked. Now as some of you might know, I, I am a vegan. I don't eat things with animal products in them, so I won't be able to eat this. I might just give it to some of the turtles outside. <laughs> that would be that would be weird, but they would probably like it. They don't know that it's about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And you can see, there you go. Doesn't look half bad. So Mike, let's throw it over to you. How's it going with that 
puzzle. I have nothing to say right now. To throw it back to you. I'm still a little mad at you. That sounds great, thanks. I love the sound of it too. Mike, let's throw it back to you with a puzzle. How's it I've going? I've made a little bit of progress. You idiot. The key is to kind of start with the corners and work your way in, inward. And another easy thing you can do is look at the faces. And lucky for me, the turtles have, they each have their own unique color band across their, their little faces, so it's easy to tell who is who. How, how have you been going? How's the cheese doing? Yeah, it's going great, by the way. Thanks for asking. Let's get a close-up of the sound. Mike? Mike, how you doing on that stupid puzzle thing? Hey, you freak. It's going pretty good here. Making, definitely making some progress. It's really, really getting along on this corner over here. And I have all four corner pieces, even though they're really not much of a corner. But I'm working along on those. And the middle part is always the most difficult, as anyone who completes puzzles uh, will know. Oh, that's great. Good job. So, having said that, I think I'm going to go ahead and throw it back to you, jerk. Go ahead. Let's go back to the mac and cheese. The main the main video that people are interested in this is the macaroni and cheese. And this is what it looks like. So, that's about... I don't have, really have much else to say about it. Mike, let's throw it back to you with a puzzle. How's it going? You idiot. Alright, it's been about another 20 minutes or so, making a little bit more progress. Don't know if I have complete time to finish this whole thing. Um, but yeah, it's going great. How about you? How's the stupid macaroni and cheese going? Yeah, it's going great, by the way. Thanks for asking. Mike, how's it going on the puzzle? Are you, are you done yet, you big dummy? Coming along pretty good here, Mike. Thanks for checking in. That looks great. You did a great job on that. Just got a few more pieces here left to go. And then we can see what the finished product looks like. Back to you, loser. Mike, let's throw it back to you with a puzzle. How's it going? You idiot. Just made some major progress here. Really starting to chisel, that, chisel this down to the last few pieces. So I'm really looking forward to seeing what this finished work of art will look like. Once I get through it. How's that uh, cheese coming along? Yeah, it's going great, by the way. Thanks for asking. So, Mike, let's throw it over to you. How's it going with that puzzle? Hey, Mike. Thanks for checking back in. Look at this. We got the outside totally finished. A few more pieces left. The tension is building. Look at this. Oh, that's great. Good job. I hope your little review is going well. Yeah, it's going great, by the way. Thanks for asking. So maybe we should just stay with me until we finish. That would be great. And I'll just talk people through it as we go along. So you can see here, really narrowing it down to these last few pieces in the middle. It's sort of mishmashed in there. These are the most difficult pieces, really, for any type of puzzle that you do. Because it's really just a lot of, di a lot of different shells. you got swords and shells. And you don't know who it belongs to. So that's what makes it a little challenging. But I think with a little bit of focus, we can get through this. And whatever. So, Mike, let's throw it over to you. How's it going with that puzzle? Hey, you nincompoop. We're down to the last two pieces. Very exciting. We can finally see what this will look like when we get it all done. What's it going to be? There's one. There we go. Looks pretty similar to the box, wouldn't you say?
Well, that's it for me. Thanks for uh, watching this double feature. And we'll go back to Mike and let, let that idiot close it out. Can you slide it over to me? That would be great. Thank you. And there it is. Beat this. Eat this. As I would say. But there you go. Oops. You got the puzzle and the uh, macaroni and cheese. I'm really looking forward to the new movie coming out. I might wait until it comes out on DVD, but either way, I can't wait to check it out. Thanks for watching, and don't forget about uh, the trivia questions. If you answer all those right, then that's great. And about identifying the character pieces, you will get a free shout out in my next video. All the best.